What's poppin'? It's the beast of rap, rock solid with the best hands in the rap game. Though I'm a rap artist, I'm also a natural drug-free bodybuilding champion. I've been boxing for over 20 years. I'm a fight fanatic. Been watching MMA, UFC since the 90s. I've been lifting these heavy-ass weights and watching boxing since the 80s. So I know my shit. This is the channel you come to when you want to see boxing and MMA content. When you want to see the fight reactions, the fight reviews, the breakdowns, and the tale of the tapes with no bias. And not only that, you get to hear some dope-ass motivational, inspirational music by your boy Rock Solid. I write all my own lyrics. I'm real in everything that I say. And I also produce, film, direct, edit all my own music videos. So what the fuck are you waiting for? Subscribe. So this just happened, y'all. Tom Aspinall just knocked out Sergey. I was shocked. I was just convinced this is going to be the UFC Fedor. I'm going to tell y'all why I think I thought Aspinall was going to lose. Everybody has him so hyped up. I'm like, man, I just feel like it's not his time yet. Like, like he's just not going to live up to the expectations put people are putting on him already to beat John Jones and everything, right? But uh, I was wrong. I'm so glad I didn't bet money because I was going to bet money on Sergey. But when I saw the lines was like so close, it was pointless to bet. But I'm mad that I was going to bet on Jessica Andra, just $75 to beat, uh, to knock out Mackenzie Dern. I knew Mackenzie Dern wasn't ready. And I'd be damned if she didn't knock her out, bro. I did not bet on it. Well, by the time I went to go bet on it, before the fight started, they already closed the betting lines. I could have had 475 right now, and I'm fucking pissed off. But uh, Tom Aspinall did it. So which, who who you think's next? Like, John Jones is going to be out probably for a good year. So if you're the interim champ, so is, are they just going to have Stipe and John Jones fight, and then Aspinall gets the winner of that? Because if that's the case, they don't make no sense because you already got a champ. So why even have an interim champ? Right? Anyways, let me know. I'm rock solid on that. I mean, everybody, look. Everybody in light heavyweight has got injured. They got stripped, right? So, John Jones got injured. You didn't strip him. You let him keep it. I don't know. I'm out.